cooking with cocoa! Cocoa powder! Which is delicious! But not cocoa powder, it's actually a little girl named Coco! Um, we did this last episode, except I thought something glitched out and I got the quest again in between episodes and I didn't record it, but now she wants to cook something else, so you guys didn't miss much. But she needs goat butter. Yeah, one day! I don't know if we have goat butter on us, but I know where to get it, so we'll be back? Hey! That one will cost you 600 rupees! Alright! That's fine, give it to me, baby! Mmm, delicious, that's perfect for you! And these pants too, good sir! I am nearly gonna be broke after this! Oh my god, I actually need more rupees to get this! But I'm actually gonna get these! Um, hello everyone, and welcome back to some more Let's Play Legends of the Breath of the Wild last episode! My god, we- Ah, uh, what did we do? I don't know, it's been a little bit since I recorded. It's been literally a day and a half since I recorded last time. Open beds here, you sluts! Um... I'm getting this. Is that stupid? I don't know. It, I actually don't know if you guys have any input on that yet. You guys might have said, please do not get that, and I just went and got it. Um, that might be what happened, but shit, man, too late now. Um, I kind of want it. Um, gee, look at me! I'm so cute! I'm a cutie! Um, if I could get this, that'd be pretty nice, but I'm gonna need to sell some shit, so I'll be back! I would like to be broke, please, sir. Thank you so much. Um, I don't know, man. This armor set just kind of, uh, it's just, like, here's my train of thought. I don't know if you guys are going to agree. Like I said, this is, I don't have your input on getting that yes or no yet, but I got it anyway. And why is the fact that, Jesus, I didn't want me to fall that far. Um, over there is cold and like past this tiny part, well, not even tiny. It's actually pretty gigantic part of this area that's cold, which is pretty much all of this. Th looks like this entire region's gonna be cold. So yeah, I think I'm gonna want cold resist close. Like, a suit specifically made for that. Now, what I'm actually gonna do really quick is actually head over to the ferry. Oh my god, I got one. Okay, that's the way to do it. It's called patience. It's been like 50 episodes since I was like, I wonder if I sneak up on the fairies if I could get it. But I always still ran at them. Like that. <laughs> My god, we've never had two fairies at one time. This is kind of rad. I wonder what the cap is here. Oh, uh, I'm here to power up that armor we just got. I don't know if it's going to power up to something good, but it's going to power up to something better than what it is. And that's all that matters to me. Uh... Yeah, I don't care. I have three fucking fairies and Mipha's Grace is on the way. Uh, hey, how you doing, fairy? Come on out, baby. How deep is that by, uh, mm. just out of curiosity? Because you, you can hold your breath for a long fucking time. Uh. Also, it must be pretty fucking deep. Yeah, enhance, please. Enhance, uh, these. Bring this up to mm. five, I guess? Yeah, that's fine. Uh, uh red true jelly and... Yeah, I could do red chew jelly. I got- I got red chew jelly, baby! Uh, well, I need red chew jelly for the entire thing because I don't have that much. Ah, uh, there you go. You should be able to- Thank you. Thank you. It's too bad there's not a cosmetic slot on this, you know what I mean? Um, I don't know. I'll be back once I'm done all of this. <laughs> Never mind! I do not have enough red chew jelly. Uh... That could be remedied. We're actually in a cold zone right now, so I'm gonna put this on for the first time. That- that heated me up. Putting that on heated me up. I'm kind of cute. All right. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm actually here to get red chew jelly. How do you get red chew jelly, you might be asking? Not by slamming your legs into the ground at such a high velocity like I just did. Um, I guess how you do it, um is you gotta find like choo-choos and for some reason i'm thinking specifically ice choo-choos i know there are some around here hey there you are how you doing and uh swing at them while the the blade is hot i think i think do it link i think you're a little pinkest dink all right go is that good Red what the hell that's blue Oh my god. Oh god, this is bad. Oh, I'm on the Great Plateau again, by the way. I'm in the ice spot of the Great Plateau. How you doing? White shoe jelly. Maybe I have to hit them when they're frozen? There might be some more upriver this way. I have no idea. Choo-choos, I'm here for you. Does calling out to a choo-choo just sound like a fucking train? Yeah, probably. All right, he's iced up. Red? No. 
Really? This has worked before. You guys told me how to do this, but I thought I read through it properly. Like, read through your comment properly. I guess not? That's odd. Okay, um... I guess we're just gonna be out of red chew jelly for now. Odd! Uh, hey. Good day. Whoa, I just realized that you're a Hylian. You just wandering around Hyrule trying to find yourself? Yeah, sure. I'm here on my honeymoon, but this town is seriously a hole. In Gerudo Town, they've got jewelry to buy, Zora's domain is always a hoot with all of the weird spiritual fish people, but here, I just want to go home already. That's kind of rude. Give me a break already. I can't believe my husband bought, brought me here for our honeymoon. He already apologized, but if he doesn't want a divorce, I told him he'd better bring me a baked apple pie. The apple of my eye. Wait, are we trying to sweep this woman off her feet? Because that seems a little inappropriate. She's kind of, kind of like married as of very recently, I guess. Um, I'm actually going to, for the time being, um, get back into my, wait, what? It's this. Thank you, Jesus. Get back into my usual armor. Um, because, screw it, baby. Because, screw it, baby. That's the answer. Uh, wait, where is everything? All right, I'm all suited back up. Um, I'm actually gonna change this back to this. Um, I think, all right, baked apple pie. Actually, don't we have apple pie? We have apple pie, don't we? I didn't eat it. That, don't we have it as of like, la the hell? Here, you want this? Is this, this what you want? Hey, really? He really thought this freezing cold town in the middle of nowhere was a good place to celebrate our love? I can't believe my husband brought me here out for our honeymoon. He already apologized, but blah, blah, blah. Baked apple. Oh, no pie. All right. It's a baked apple. Baked apple. Hold the pie, please. Oh my God. Oh, that's rad. That's rad. Am I going back to the stable? I'm ultimately trying to... Yeah, there it is. I'm trying to get back to the stable because I'm not sure exactly where the uh, cooking pot there is. God damn, that shadow of that divine beast is creepy, man. Whoa. Okay. Um, so I didn't want to dawdle around. I know there's one over here and this really isn't that far off. So I've come over here to fucking bake an apple to save a marriage. God damn it. Yes, that is seriously what this has come to. Um, is it as simple as this? Can I just drop it by the side and have it bake? Because I know this is how you make a baked apples. It's, it's on fire. There it is. <gasps> Sorry, I'll get your quest in a second. I'm going to save a marriage. Actually, that's stupid. Fuck it. I'll get your quest now. What do you want? Need curry rice. Everybody here needs food and that's their quests. God damn, the nights sure are cold. Spicy! I need that Bernie tingle! I need a curry rice! Now, I have Hylian rice on hand, which I need to make curry rice, but I'm fresh out of Goron spice! I can't just run out off and leave the stable. If you happen to have some on your Goron has spice on your hands, I don't have it. Well, I guess that means I'll have to catch the freezing death. The, I, that's not what he said, but god damn it, that was words to the effect, and that's really dark and depressing. All right, let's go save a marriage. Hey, wake up. Got some, uh, got some news. Wait, what? Seriously? I can't. Oh, that's great. I can't fucking give you. All right. Uh, yeah. One, one bed, please. Oh my god. I, I'm broke. I can't even afford a $20 bed. Why did I buy this armor? Oh my god, it's morning, and she's gone. What the hell, dude? I got your baked apple. I'm just here to save your goddamn marriage. I wish there were more quests like some of the ones that we have to do yet. And also, there was one quest one time where we had to head down to a beach and clear it because the, the Bokoblins took the livestock of like some farmers or something. I kind of forget what that was about. But like, there are too many quests that's like, please go bake me an apple, I guess. And then it's like, all right, if that's what you want me to do. It's just, don't get me wrong, I, I love the fact that there are a ton of filler quests in this game and I'd rather it be that way than not. But like, I just kinda, I, there are quests that are more fun than go get an apple. Anyway, here you go. Morning, morning. Oh, I know that smell. You've got a baked apple. Can I have one? I'll give you a present. Yeah, sure thing. You serious? Cheers, just hold out your hand. Ah, uh, that kinda makes up for it. Now, if only I- if I could only get my husband to cook me a baked apple every once in a while. I've got a second stomach and a hollow leg for baked apples. Bring me as many as you possibly can. 
Wait, what? You won't give me a fucking hundred rupees every... Hold on, I need to test this. Yes, good morning, ma'am. None of those are cooking. None of those... They all rolled away. Good morning, my fine gentleman. Just, uh, gonna bake some apples. Is that okay, guys? Just give me... Give me... Got him. Got him, except one of them. All right, I'll be back. Excuse me, ma'am. Morning, morning. Yes, I have more apples on me. How much are you gonna give me for one? Serious, cheers. Hold out your hand. Five rupees? What the hell? All right. G I... Yeah, just take them all. You know, it's not even worth it. It's not... It's not worth sitting there clicking that much. Anyway, what is the plan you may be saying? Let's figure it out. <gasps> oh, hey, first off, before we do anything else, um, this guy had a lot to say the other episode, and I kind of skipped through it, and I kind of want to yeah. go back and see what he's saying. Hey, morning. I don't know who I'm more sick of, Divine Beast, Vamoa, Meadow, or my mom. I don't... I don't want to just help. Aww. I want to open my own store and sell whatever I want. Uh, okay. Well, I'm glad we came back to talk to you. Maybe you should. See you later, alligator. <laughs> Divine Beast Vemedo. Um, we're actually going to get started on this. I don't know if that's the good thing to do here. Um, you guys will have to let me know if there's any quests at all that I need to come mop up in this area, and I totally will do it. Um, maybe not right away, but we will- God, these guys have the same conversation every single day, same time, that part of the boardwalk. It's just weird to me. Um, we're gonna get started on the Divine Beast quest. I'm not sure if we're gonna do this right away or not. I have no idea. I guess it's just a matter of time. Um, you know what? Something other games do that is actually kind of helpful with their low quest markers is they make it so that you can tell where the elevation lies. Um, specifically for Rito Village so far, it's been very difficult to understand where this quest is. Do I have to come all the way up here? Hey, how you doing, Saki? Oh. The Traveler. Forgive my intrusion, but I overheard you speaking with the Elder. It sounds like you intend to help my husband, Taba, in the fight against Meadow. But, to tell the truth, there is not much I can do for you right now beyond telling you where my husband went. Where did he go? Well, my husband headed to a place called the Flight Range. It's in Dro Dronax Pass at the base of the Hebra Mountains. It's a place where Rito warriors prepare for aerial combat. I imagine he's gone there to gather weapons for another run at Meadow. As it happens, he made his way to the flight range on foot this time. Okay, yeah, I've been there, actually. <laughs> See those mountains? That's not at all where it is. If you take off from Rivali's Landing, it's a straight shot down to f the flight range. Rivali's Landing is a memorial for the Rito champion, Rivali. So named in the hope that none might forget the events of that horrible day. <laughs> Aww. Remember that bird guy? I love that. What are we doing? What's with this camera angle? Oh my god, oh my god, it's a piece of wood! Holy shit! I remember this wood! I love that big bird. Oh. Can you not cause such a windstorm? Please and thanks. Impressive, I know. Very few can achieve a mastery of the sky. Yet I have made an art of creating an updraft that allows me to soar. It's considered to be quite the masterpiece of aerial techniques, even among the Rito. With uh -huh. proper utilization of my superior skills, I see no reason why we couldn't easily dispense with Ganon. Now then. Dude, what a cocky bird. Is certainly of note. But let's not, pardon me for being so blunt, let's not forget the fact that I am the most skilled archer of all the Rito. Yet despite these truths, it seems that I've been tapped to merely assist you. All because you happen to have that little darkness ceiling sword on your back. I mean, it's just asinine. Gee. Unless... You think you can prove me wrong? Maybe we should just settle this one-on-one. -on -one. But where? <laughs> one v oh, one, me Russ, know. right now, bro. How about up there? Okay. 
No, you must pardon me. I forgot you have no way of making it up to that divine beast on your own. See ya! Good luck sealing the darkness! Fucking dick! Sorry, sorry, just remember my bird friend. Descendant! Descendant, are you alright? My apologies. I fear I have said far too much. Is If there is anything you do not understand, please do not hesitate to ask. No, I just don't understand what a cocky dick that you guys are all appreciating so much up here. Nah, I love him. I He's probably one of my favorite characters so far. I really like him. Hey, you wanna talk? Hello. Say, Traveler. I take it you've seen Divine Beast Vameto? Uh, no! What are you talking about? Where is it? What are you talking about, ma'am? Everyone is at a loss of what to do. I can't help but sigh every time I look upward. When will we be able to get back- go back to living a relaxed life here? Ah, uh, soon! Just hold your goddamn horses, lady. Wait, did she- Not say it's a straight shot to the fucking- Wait, what? It's a straight shot there if you take- Oh, you gotta go off from this direction. Well, see ya! There's a house in the way. Hold on, hold on, there's a house in the way. It's a straight shot if you take off from the top of this house. Am I even gonna have enough stamina? Maybe. Possibly. I'm gonna head over here. Because I don't know if I'm actually gonna make that cliff. Um. Oh shit, we've already been. We could probably just teleport. In fact, we might still just teleport because that still makes the most sense. Sort of. I did actually- you know what? We're gonna actually take a stroll. <laughs> Let's take a stroll together, y'all! Um, and quickly, I'm actually gonna slip on this. I'm a bird man! Um, what we're gonna- uh, why I'm actually just gonna let this go. Gee, thanks! Um, why I'm actually gonna let this go is because I did actually use a lot of my fucking- What, you see me from that far? Really? That's actually really impressive, my man. Um, I did use a lot of my frickin' whatchamacallit, uh, the food! Food is the whatchamacallit. I used a lot of my food to sell, uh, maybe I shouldn't have? I don't know, but I'm actually gonna go hunting if I can along the way. Um, something that we haven't done this episode that we will surely be doing in not even that long from now is, um, using amiibos. In fact, we'll use them as soon as this guy fucking dies. Please, sir, I just die in a fire. Also, something that should be stated is I have no idea where we are. Really? I cleared him. I have no idea where we are in the episode. So this episode, I know I said this like a couple episodes ago and it turned out that it was actually 30 minutes, but this episode might be a little shorter. I'm sorry. I've been recording for 40 minutes. I have no idea where we are in this episode, but my timer's only saying 20. But I know that I didn't start the timer for a good portion of the episode. So, with that being said, let's at least do Amiibo. Um, hit me up with- Oh, we only have two Amiibo on us right now. Well, three, including Wolf Link, but two- Speaking of Wolf Link, let's get him in here. I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't. Screw it. He's in! The boy is in now, baby! And then, let's get in Sheik. Um, because, screw it, I only have Sheik and Ocarina of Time Link on me. Um, Courtney took the rest of them. Um, to play with by herself, uh, and we're not in the same place anymore. So, friggin- Frenic Bow. Yeah, that's good, actually. Probably. I don't know. Maybe. Anyway, Ocarina of Time Link, please, my boy. Do you need any of those? You can have them. You can have them if you want them, my boy. Icy meat. Yeah, yeah, that's good, but let me- God damn it. That's sliding away! Alright, give me this. Please complete the set. Nope. Um, I actually will kind of sort of take that unless, unless I can't, yeah, I can't. God, we gotta go see the fucking, what's his name? Tree boy. Good old tree boy. Hey, you, you up here? Actually, I think there is somebody up here now. There wasn't before. Hey, I'm wearing your armor. Isn't that cool? Can we be friends? You up here? Taking a nap? He's not napping. What are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> yeah? Tabba Rito Warrior! You seem kind of badass, dude. I don't know you. And I'm actually pretty busy here. You should probably go. Okay. See you later. <laughs> I'm gonna hit the road then. 
Is that really that? That's the intro cutscene for him? Great. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna talk to Teba next episode. Uh, in between episodes, I'll cook some shit. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this episode, please give it a like. If you guys want to subscribe for the remainder of Let's Play, please do so. Uh, do I have salt? Yes, so I'm extending the episode to find salt. Um, come back next time. I don't know, man. We'll talk to Pr Teba. Ya boy Teba. And we'll see if he's as much of a dick as he seems so far. Yeah.